Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss the types of flooring material and different materials available for floor finishing and which material is better for floors. We will also discuss the considerations while discussing the different flooring materials and what considerations should be taken into account while selecting different types of materials and what are merits and demerits of these materials. But before we start our today's topic, if you are new visitor or new on my channel, you are requested to please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get video updates. So let's start our today's topic. First of all, one should understand the purpose of floor. The purpose of floor is to provide a level surface and to support live and dead loads. And the floor must satisfy the following requirements, adequate strength and stability, adequate fire resistance sound insulation, damp resistance, thermal insulation and these requirements must be satisfied by the floor or on the basis of these you will make decision which material is better for you. And now there are two types of floors, mainly ground floor and upper floors. Flooring components include subfloor and floor coverings. In this video, we are going to discuss floor coverings one by one. What is ground floor? Ground floor may rest directly above the ground or may be supported at a little distance above the ground. And floors supported directly above the ground are known as solid floors while the floors supported above the ground level are known as suspended floors. Coming towards the selection of flooring material, one should must keep in mind these points before selecting the flooring materials that it is its initial cost, its appearance, its cleanliness, its durability, its damp resistance, its sound insulation, thermal insulation, fire resistance, smoothness, hardness and maintenance. So these are the few points which should which everyone should keep in mind before selecting the flooring materials. Now, if we talk about the layer wise construction of floor or solid ground floor, lowest layer is made up of compacted earth fill. The second layer made either of lean concrete or lime concrete or sometimes broken brick pads or stones rammed properly. Third layer made either of cement concrete or of bricks or stones arranged and packed properly. Fourth layer constitutes of floor finish. Here we will discuss about floor finishing materials and this is the fourth layer of the floor. Now if we talk about the floor finishing materials which are widely used all over the world, first one is mud finish, flagstones, concrete, terrazzo, mosaic, tiles, linoleum floor, wood or timber, plastic or PVC, marble, rubber, glass and cork. We will discuss the advantages, disadvantages, merits and uh, merits of these materials one by one. First one is mud flooring used for unimportant buildings particularly in villages. What are its merits? It is cheap, hard and fairly impervious. It is easy in construction and maintenance and it also have good thermal insulation. Demerits, it is the only well suited for small village houses. Brick flooring it is suitable for cheap construction used in places where heavy articles are to be stored, for example, warehouses, stores and go-downs. Used in alluvial places where stone is scarce and well-burned bricks are readily available. Coming towards merits, it's durable and hard. It is non-slippery and fire resistant. Initial cost is less and it is easy in maintenance. It must have few demerits, which is it is absorbent. It absorbs water or moisture. The third material is flagstone flooring. Stones with rough surfaces are used on the rough works like good on sheds, stores, etc. Stones with polished surfaces are used. What are its merits? It is hard, durable and wear resisting. It is easy in construction, repair and maintenance. Demerits, appearance is unattractive and it is rough stones. Poor shock absorbing characteristics. 
सरफेस इज अन इवन सीमेंट कंक्रीट फ्लोरिंग यूज फॉर रेजिडेंशियल कमर्शियल एंड इंडस्ट्रियल बिल्डिंग्स द फ्लोर कंसिस्ट ऑफ टू कंपोनेंट्स द टू कंपोनेंट ऑफ द फ्लोर कैन बी कंस्ट्रक्टेड इधर मोनोलिथिकली और नॉन मोनोलिथिकली बेस कोर्स फर्स्ट लेयर इज बेस कोर्स एंड इट मे बी सेवन पॉइंट फाइव टू टेन सेंटीमीटर थिक इट मे बी इधर इन लीन कंक्रीट हैविंग रेशियो वन थ्री सिक्स और वन फाइव टेन और लाइम कंक्रीट कंटेनिंग फोर्टी परसेंट मोटर और वन रेशो टू लाइम एंड सेंड एंड सिक्सटी परसेंट कोर्स एग्रीगेट दी टॉपिंग टॉपिंग इज देन लेड इन स्क्वेयर और रेक्टेंगुलर पैनल ऑफ साइज वन बाय वन और टू बाय टू और वन बाय टू मीटर इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ वन रेशो टू रेशो फोर सीमेंट कंक्रीट मेरिट्स ऑफ सीमेंट कंक्रीट फ्लोरिंग it it is resistant to dampness it possesses high durability it provides a smooth hard and even surface can be easily cleaned and is and it is economical fire resistant demerits defects once developed cannot be easily rectified does not provide sound and heat insulation terrazzo flooring it is laid in thin layer over concrete topping very decorative and has good wearing properties used in residential buildings hospitals offices schools and other public buildings it is expensive mosaic flooring made of small pieces of broken tiles of china glazed cement marble arranged in different patterns tiles used are available in variety of patterns and colors commonly used in operation theaters masjids bathrooms and superior type of buildings floors tile flooring constructed from a square or any other shape made of clay cement or terrazzo available in different sizes and thickness used in residential houses offices schools and other public buildings an alternative to terrazzo flooring merits non absorbent decorative and durable quick laying of floors easily repaired demerits initial maintenance cost is high on becoming wet provides a slippery surface marble flooring superior type of flooring used in residential buildings masjid hospitals etc where cleanliness is required marble slabs may be square or rectangular timber flooring it is costly used for carpentry halls dancing halls auditorium halls etc common in hilly areas where timber is cheap and available entire area below the floor is covered with an impervious material cement concrete or asphalt to prevent dampness elastic in nature resistant to wear and tear rubber flooring consist of sheets or tiles of rubber in a variety of patterns and colors with thickness varying from 3 to 10 mm sheet or tile is manufactured by mixing pure rubber with fillers such as cotton fiber granulated cork or asbestos fiber sheets tiles are fixed to concrete base by appropriate adhesives resilient and noise proof they are costly used in office or public buildings linoleum flooring a covering available in rolls which is spread directly on concrete or wooden flooring linoleum sheets may be plain or printed it may be 2 to 6 mm thick and 2 to 4 m wide linoleum tiles are also available linoleum coverings are attractive resilient durable cheap and can be cleaned easily it rots when gets wet hence it cannot be used for bathrooms and kitchens cork flooring cork is the outer bark of cork oak tree this is flooring this flooring is perfectly noiseless and is used in libraries theaters art galleries etc it may be in the form of either carpet or tiles it is fixed to a concrete base its size varies from 10 cm to 10 cm to 30 cm into 90 cm and thickness varies from 5 mm to 15 mm glass flooring it is used where light is to be transmitted from upper floor to the lower floor structural glass is available in the form of tiles or slabs 
its thickness varies from 12 to 30 mm these slabs or tiles are fixed in closely spaced frames it is very costly and therefore not commonly used plastic or pvc flooring it is made of plastic material fabricated in the form of tiles of different sizes and color shades widely used in all types of buildings the tiles are laid on concrete base the floor is washed with warm soap water before use it is resilient smooth good looking and can be cleaned easily it is costly and slippery and is damaged when comes in contact with burning objects that's all for today in the end you are again requested if you are new to my channel you are requested to please subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon to get video updates